So this idea was brought to me by my sister. She saw my Get to the morning gang. So the stickers I'm gonna order today, I'm gonna order the black one, and then I'm gonna order the mystery one. Ooh. And look at this new steering wheel cover I got. Amazon, baby, it's money. I am on my way to the store right now to get something special for Garrett's coffee bar. Not gonna name any names, but someone got pretty mad that I haven't done one in a while. So I'm gonna do one in a second. And then next week, I've got a really special one. I ordered something really cool, and it's gonna, it's gonna be a really cool episode of Garrett's coffee bar. Okay, so I got the supply. Supply? Supplies? I don't know. I got this, uh, the whatever I needed. Coffee bar time. Welcome to another episode of Garrett's Coffee Bar. The secret item that I got at the store was an ice cube tray. And I think you know what we're gonna do with this guy. So this idea was brought to me by my sister. She saw my video where I was trying to make the iced coffee without the, like, using water ice because then hot coffee and ice just melts the water, makes it watered down iced coffee. So she said, what if you just filled ice cube trays with coffee and then froze it and then put the coffee in the iced coffee, coffee ice, and then you'll make non-watered down iced coffee. And I was like, hey, it's a good idea. coffee bar -er -ers. this one it's gonna get crazy all right so I'm gonna try to do this with a minimum amount of mess which will probably not happen oh yeah it's going bad it's going real bad I'm gonna go do this over the sink okay I think that's pretty good I was trying to do a slow pour to get all of them like evenly and then the coffee overflowed and it got on my hand and it's really hot coffee so my hands burning now so I just poured it everywhere, so I mean, I think this is good enough. Let's go pop this in the freezer, and then I'll be back once it's frozen. Okay, so while the ice cubes are freezing, I'm going to go ahead and order the stickers, and then I'm going to tell you about next week's Garrett's Coffee Bar. It's going to be in the beginning of the week, but I ordered some more coffee, and like I've never tried this one before. I don't know anybody who has, so I'm going to do like a taste test on it, and then like my impressions on the coffee. That'll be next week and you'll have to wait to see which coffee I got. All right guys, the ice cubes are all frozen. They kind of look like the embryo off of uh, Jurassic Park with the little mosquito in it, they look cool. But okay, they're frozen solid. And then I got our coffee that we're gonna put the ice cubes into. So let's get to it. Here's the ice cubes that are the coffee, and here's the hot coffee we're gonna pour into it. Try to let that cool down. I might add a few more ice cubes into it. Whoa. Man, this is coffee-y. Like, this tastes like black, black coffee. So, if you're gonna make this, I advise you put the coffee in the ice cube trays the night before and uh, be prepared for a very strong drink because this is this is pretty strong but it did work it the ice hasn't melted uh, it doesn't taste like watered down iced coffee I mean it's it's a money idea but it's very strong and it does take a while for the ice to freeze I hope you guys enjoyed the episode of Garrett's coffee bar drop a like if you did like it and drop it a like if you actually try some of the stuff I make, either if it's on smoothie bar, coffee bar, or just like anything I've made on here. Drop a like.
So the stickers, I'm going to order the black and white one. The black, the black one with like the white border, that's going to be the circle one. I'm going to order 10 of those, 10, 10. But the mystery sticker will not necessarily be a circle sticker. I'm going to try out something new and I'm still going to make it really sick. But you're not going to see it until I, like I get the sticker. It's going to be a total mystery, but I think you're going to like them a lot. I just ordered the stickers and the mystery sticker, I have to say, is really sick. I just made it and I really, I think it's pretty cool. Uh, but I hope you guys like it. They should be here next. Yeah, next Wednesday around there. It's big pole time right now. We're going up to big pole. Practice was so good today. I got on my I got on my big boy pole today. On uh, the video it was like the bungee was at like 14.6 or 15. I really don't know where it was at. But I got on the pole. It's the first time I vaulted on that pole, the first time the pole's been vaulted on. So that was really awesome. I got over it. I wouldn't count it a clean clear. I pulled it down quite a bit, but like I swung up, I was on it, so I I think that was a good day today. And the meet tomorrow is supposed to be like completely terrible. Like I'm talking 50 mile an hour gusts. It's supposed to be like 40 degrees. I think there's a chance of snow tomorrow, like scattered showers. So I don't know if we're gonna pole vault tomorrow. We're still gonna go and stuff, but like the weather is supposed to be worse than Portales. And we all know how bad that was. But I don't know, we're still gonna go. We're still probably gonna try to vault. It's up to the meet officials if they want to cancel the meet or not, or just cancel pull vault. So I don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow, but we're still gonna go. We're still gonna try, try to get our vaulty vaulty on. Good to the morning, gang. I'm headed right now to the track. We're about to go to Clovis, and the wind is already really bad right now. It's like here, it's blowing like 40. So in Clovis, you could say it's probably blowing at like 120 but it's probably gonna be pretty bad so i don't know i guess we'll find out once we get there pole vault is starting at six because it it's is so postponed. windy it's been postponed terrible weather out here we'll be back at six and if it's canceled it's canceled michael Get warmed up. Get warmed up, boys. Yeah. So we are leaving right now. Way too cold. Raining. Uh, really windy. Polvo was canceled. I can't feel my hands right now. So we're on our way back to Carlsbad. No track vlog. I'm sorry. Did you miss me? Good to the morning gang. I'm sorry that yesterday's supposed to be track vlog wasn't like anything at all We got there and the pole vault mat was already like blown over the track and so was the high jump mat so We fixed the mats and then they postponed it until 6 So then at 6 o'clock it started sleeting so it was like sleeting the was blowing it was like 40 degrees so, I mean, the coach just said, like, no, I don't want y'all pole vaulting in this. And then we left the meet, like, shortly after that. Like, I don't, I don't even think that we had anyone compete. Like, everyone was just warming up and, like, getting ready to. And the coach was like, no, let's go home. So, I mean, there was no track vlog. We left, like, at 5 and something like that. And we are supposed to get back at, like, 3 in the morning. But we got back at, like... Nine. I'm fixing to head to work right now. We have a tournament again this morning. It's tournament season, baby. RCC. Just getting off of work right now. I'm gonna get my swim trunks and then I'm gonna go over to Jordan's house because we're gonna go wakeboarding. Good to have Jim and Aaron. We'll just Photoshop their faces. No, they could like. Aaron and Jim could be like. Alright, so we have Jake and Adam and Jake. Boys. Stuff like that, you know? <sighs>
lost money. Yeah, Jakin, yeah. Is it cold, Jakin? Just getting done wakeboarding right now. It was super fun. It was super cold out there, but I got some cool footage. I put the GoPro on. GoPro on me and Jordan. Got videos of me, Jordan, Adam, Reagan, uh, Kaden, and JP. So it was fun. Probably go out next weekend because it was really fun. But now Jordan's coming over to my house and I'm gonna help him build his uh, bike that he just bought. So JP's new bike is sexy as heck. Look at that girl. Mmm! Damn! <laughs> Merry Christmas, Jordan! <laughs> Dang! <laughs> Get out of my damn yard! <laughs> okay, since Jordan just built his bike, we're gonna go test it out on a track somewhere. Not a track, we're gonna go drive down a hill. I am just getting back from mountain biking right now. We had a lot of fun. I'll take my GoPro next time we were just testing out JP's new bike. But I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys for watching. Like the video if you liked the video. Like the video if you didn't like the video. I put a new video up every Wednesday and Saturday. If you're new to my channel, subscribe down below and then hit the bell next to it. Create every day. Outro, you know what to do.